Hey guys, just doing a quick video. Um, so here we have an old tape. We're gonna go ahead and remove the outer casing and replace it with some uh, some lubricant on the inside because the tape is sticking at this point. Uh, this is a tape from 1992. Um, so uh, that being the case, uh, to start off, well, let's start with the tools first. First, you're gonna need a sharp knife. Uh, Cut across the seam that, that cuts from here to there so that the label is free and clear to come off with the top of the lid. Um, the next thing you can need is some alcohol swabs, something similar. Um, basically, there are metal contacts here, here. Uh, there is a connector here, you have lube, and the top and bottoms of this. And that's it. So I'll get into that in a second. Uh, Q tips to manually go through and do that. I've already moved the screws. Uh, you need a screwdriver. Uh, I've already moved the screws. There's about five on the bottom. Uh, one here, one there, here, here, and there. So, without further ado, I'll go ahead and take this off. I'll explain the insides here to you shortly. Start with the shaky hand. I'll take this off. Again. Oh, that one fell out. All right, so there we have the inside of the case. We have two reels for the film. We have the release for the uh, the clips. They're the roundabouts that go here and there. And you need to see it's locked. If I open this up, it'll have to spring freely. There's no problem. So. Uh, we're going to go back through and lube this up. We're going to lube the top of this thickly and the bottom or heavily, uh, as well as these points here. So, that being the case, uh, we're going to go ahead and clean these sections here. And I'm just taking alcohol rubbing swabs and uh, bringing them out gently so they're not heavy, heavy. Just gently wipe these down. Now these can be corroded with plastic uh, because they rub against the center of our cure or along the edge to keep the edge down. So we're going to slightly wipe that down. Make sure not to get the tape at all. Now that's it for now. Let's see here. And this looks like it fell off. Did it fall off? Yeah, I'm sure it did. So, we're going to go ahead and release this a little bit here. And I'm going to go ahead and take the film out just a tad bit. Okay. A little bit of a crusty in the air. I'll clean that out as well. Uh, but for now, let's see. I think that just goes top. Let's see, it's not the same. How you? It's in the same. It's about the same. Okay. So for this, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use a little bit of uh, oil, some light mineral oil uh, to put on here. Uh, when you do uh, fixing a tape, basically you want to make sure that you don't have an issue with things that are uh, conduct electricity, like dielectric grease. Um, I thought about graphite. Graphite would work, but that seems like an issue because it conducts electricity, same thing with grease, uh, lithium, uh, the, white, the white grease, um, only because uh, it conducts electricity too. Now, my best suggestion for this overall is to actually replace the whole unit. So in other words, take the tape out, put it in a new cassette case, 
ship it off and get it done. So, um, with this, I'm just kind of fixing it to see if I can. Uh, and then we'll, we'll go from there. If I can get this off. I'm just going to take over this. a small amount using your q-tip just to the edges now we can do the same thing with the other side as well um, I'm going to go ahead and turn this back up okay you can hear there's some issues down there with it trying to um, move so I am going to go ahead and and uh, I think I'm going to stop this video. I'm going to clean up a little bit of this. And I'll come back and discuss what that was then. But basically, I'm going to lubricate here. This point here. I'm going to lubricate underneath both these and then this. And then I've already lubricated that. So that should be good. So uh, I'll be back in a second when I have one of these rails out. And we'll go from there. Okay, we're back with some more stuff. So, uh... That's the problem getting the oil cap off the top of this. So, so um, what I'm going to do is lubricate this slightly. So, we're just going to put that in there. Rub this around just a little bit. Now, what I'm planning on doing with this is actually doing a video transfer to uh, DVD. And then from that to, to YouTube. So, um, you can see there's a line of the the tape here and the casing. You can hear that there. Anyways, that side's done. We're gonna leave this up just a tad bit. Say it takes the words up, but I'm just gonna add just a smidgen drop. There we go. Let me rub that on real quick, actually. That looks pretty good. So we're going to put that back together. Oh my god, this is a little bit inside here. And put the back together. Uh, then we got the other side to do. This goes between here and there. There we go. I think. Uh, hard to do with only one hand. Right, let me try it. Okay, that's between the two parts now. So, just gonna take a little bit of spray. So, we're looking at that and then around the other side back. Now, I did clean the bottom of these. You can see that there's a little bit of dust and stuff on the bottom of that. Uh, I'm going to leave that live for now. You can definitely see this, this uh, line on the set casing. I'm going to go ahead and wipe that out. Make sure you get the inside here. Never any on tape, so we're gonna put some in here. Let's wipe that out real quick. Okay. Um, 
Won't get away with, with uh, down a little bit. And I'll put it back together. Let's see. All right. Now, this does have a little bit of wipe on it. There's a wipe right there. I'm trying to get this on the inside of that. All right. That looks like that's it. So, uh, the verse is just putting it back together. Uh, I'm going to leave up some of the stuff in here, little springs and whatnot, but I think we'll leave it be for now. But, as I said, the, uh, the main point of this is just take it apart, lubricate it for now. As I said, the better pop pop Proposition for this uh, situation is that uh, we take the uh, case completely apart, uh, take the tape out, put this into a new case, and let it go. This t tape is over 30 years old at this point, so it's uh, it's a little bit worse of the wear and has not been taken care of. So that's the problem with this one. Uh, it will go back together now. Let me see if I can get this in there. Uh, Detach this so I can bring it down easily without having to manipulate everything. All right, uh, take a look at this. That goes in here. Okay, I'm lifting this up first. Uh, it's going down. Okay. Back together, put the screws back in, and uh, I think we're good to go. I'll give this a whirl. I'm going to um, remove and replace some of the stuff in there, or to rewind and re, re, uh, redo the thing so we can receive the, the DVD, but that's pretty much about it. So, uh, if you guys have any questions, leave them in the comments down below. Like, subscribe, share, do your things always. Uh, you know I love you. And uh, subscribe, of course, subscribe. This is the first time I take a cassette tape apart. If you have any co comments or questions about what I've done here or suggestions about what I need to do, please leave them in the comments. All right, thanks, guys. Thanks for watching.